My name is Gord Stothert. I'm the president and CEO of IM Gold. I've been with IM Gold a little over 13 years, originally joining as COO, and as of March 2020, moving to my current position as CEO. IM Gold is a mid-tier Canadian-based gold mining company. Uh, we have producing assets on three continents, the Essacan mine in Burkina Faso in West Africa, the Rosabelle mine in Suriname in South America, and the Westwood mine in the Abitibi region of Northern Quebec. In addition, we are building the Cote gold mine uh, in Northern Ontario uh, between Timmins and Sudbury, uh, and in the not too distant future, are looking to begin construction on the Boto gold mine in Senegal in West Africa. Beyond that, we have several development uh, exploration opportunities that we're looking to drive value for the company long into the future. My name is Craig McDougall. I'm the Executive Vice President of Growth with responsibility for corporate development and exploration at IM Gold. IM Gold is transitioning to a growth strategy where we're developing the Cote Gold project and we have a shovel-ready project in Senegal called Bodo, which we'll consider for development after that. With the development of these projects, our annual production will increase to well over a million ounces and we have a pipeline of projects behind that to continue to grow our resource and production base in the future. Well, ESG is hugely important for IM Gold. Um, it's an area that we focus on and have focused on for many years. We channel our efforts mostly through our zero harm vision, which we've had in place since 2007 and really guides us as to how we interact with our communities, our host governments, with the environment, with our employees. Um, Zero harm is a phrase that gets used quite often these days, but for us, uh, it's been a way we've done business for several years and have been well recognized by several agencies for our, for our efforts in that area. We look at sustainability of, of mining is really delivering benefits for the communities and the, and the environment um, through the exploitation of the minerals that will last long beyond the life of the mine. Uh, and it's a tenant that we, we hold very, very strongly. In 2021, planned exploration spending will total $56 million on greenfield and brownfield exploration programs. Our brownfield exploration program will focus on resource conversions at all of our operational sites, as well as testing regional targets with a view to discover and delineate new satellite deposits to extend mine lives at all of our operations. This will also include advancing our hub and spoke concept at the Westwood operation where we have excess mill capacity and we're focusing on evaluating projects at the Fiol and the Ruan Gold project. Our Greenfield program will focus on expanding existing resources at our resource stage projects. These include ongoing delineation programs at the Goslin Discovery at the Cote Gold project, the Diaca deposit as part of our Sirabaya Diaca project in West Africa, as well as our Nelligan project in Northern Quebec. Well, return to shareholders is one of the fundamental goals of our business, obviously of any business. At IM Gold, while we're in the growth phase, uh, our cash on, on the balance sheet will be directed towards uh, successfully executing the construction of Cote and eventually the construction of Bodo. Um, that being said, given current high gold prices and the future high margins and high production rate we expect to achieve, uh, not only from Cote and Bodo, but also uh, through continued improvement at the existing operations. We fully uh, foresee a time in hopefully the not too distant future where we can start to look at dividends and other opportunities to return value directly to shareholders, uh, as well as an expectation that we'll be able to uh, really drive our share price uh, higher as well through successful execution. 